Morning tubers. Well, I'm back in my chair today. Uh, yeah, wasn't much fun trying to do it in a truck. Bit of a bad idea. Well, anyhow, it was different, wasn't it? We're trying to do it. We're trying to make it a bit different. Um, let's see. Who's put what up, eh? Um, the Outlaw Videos SS. Nice video, mate. The hunting video. Yeah, I like that. You show me around all that land and that. That was pretty good. Um, GoPro. Now, you're saying, you know, you might not be able to turn the GoPro on quick enough, but, I mean, if you're out there and you're in a little hide somewhere or something, and uh, you can turn that on and run it for two hours, if it's got fresh battery in it, sure, you're sure you get two hours out of it. I'll get it out of mine. Um, so you could just keep the thing running, couldn't you, and then chop out what you need and run another camera. Uh, Redneck Rickham, did you win? Did you win the keyboard, or are you going to put another video up? You never said. I mean, you should have done with that video you made. That was pretty smart. Mega crazy hillbilly. Well, that old uh, that old find, eh? The old snowblower. She works. Well, there you go, bud. You can make some money if we get some snow, can't you? You can go around your area doing people's driveways. The old ladies drives and their walkways and that, can't you? That'd be good. Make some money for nothing, eh? Um, vlogging life. TGN, eh? Yeah, they're a right bunch of crooks, they sound, don't they, from what you've said. Um, don't know. Makes me think. It keeps making me think. You know, at least with YouTube, uh, you might not make as much money, but, uh, you know, you still got all your rights to your videos, haven't you? I mean, they can't kibosh them so much, can they? Or maybe they can. I don't know. You'll tell me, I expect, anyhow, won't you? Um, what else we got? Video responses. A few re video responses. Now, like I said, these video responses, if you want to see them, they are in the last few videos. And I think there's a few that have gone up on the video I did called Video Responses. Um, yeah, I think they're on there. Um, who have we got? Two Lee Products. He's the guy that uh, put that, that video response up about that engine that he started in his garden, yeah? And I asked him where it came from. And yeah, he put two videos up and it comes out of an F-350. Um, and one of the videos, they pull a freaking car out of the ground with it. It's quite good. And he showed that he, he took off, it was an injection engine, and he, he put a carburetor on it. And he's like vacuum thing and that. Yeah, pretty pretty clever, mate. Yeah. Didn't know you could do that, actually. Well, I thought you had to change that whole manifold. Um, Sean C. Farm. Another engine start-up, bud. Yeah, that quite surprised you that it started up that quick, eh? Yeah, what, are you gonna, what did you put that in? Did you put it in something? Was that the one used in the tank? Or was it the tank? Yeah, I don't know. Um, belts towing, nice truck, mate. Beautiful truck, that tow truck. Uh, didn't quite get the video though. I don't know. Maybe I should go and have a look at the other another one around it and see. Did you do something? Did you have it painted up something for cancer or something? I don't know. I, I didn't. I didn't quite get it. Um, Walker Adventures. Uh, nice little go-kart. You said you got it for free. Free's always good. Did you put a new engine in it or was that the original one? But free's always good. Um, the North 03. Yeah, you've been watching my video, I think, about the dog, eh? And the teeth. I don't think I could do that to my dog. She wouldn't like it and she'd probably bite me. Yeah, good video, though. How to clean your dog's teeth. Yeah, I don't know if I put my fingers in my dog's mouth. No. Uh, last one. Cornish Morgan. Yeah, mate, that train video, that did, did take me back, it did. I remember I, I've spent a lot of time in England. Uh, we used to get around a lot by trains, especially up into London and that. It was easier to go by train and try and drive there half the time. And yeah, stood on cold, rainy platforms waiting for trains to come in. Um, the, com the commentator, commentary commentator guy, or whoever he is, the guy that says, oh, the train on platform one and all that. Uh, I remember it all used to be live. And there would be some guy sat up in a booth somewhere and he'd, as the trains come in, he'd say it over a microphone and other like things and that, yeah. Don't know if they still do that or not. Don't know, but yeah, it did take me back a bit, mate. It really did. Nice one. Um, let's see, it's Sunday. Um, I had a phone call from Graham a little while ago. That's uh, Gear Loose 100. Um, I got a ring him back, telling me, yeah, I'm going to farm. I'm going to meet him up there. I think where's Bobby's going to turn up? I think Tyler's going to come up there. The Trouble and Strife's come in. Um, hopefully there'll be a few more people. Who knows what we're going to get up to. Maybe some field racing or something. Um, still got to strip those tyres down there uh, for the alley off the wheels. Um, yeah, 
So anyhow, I'm going to shut this bit down now. I'll take you with me and, I don't know, see what we get up to. If not, we'll be at the farm next. Oh, I ain't got my box, have I? <laughs> I've to do it by hand, won't I? Oh well, there you go. Well, made it down to the farm. Look who's here, my buddy Graham. How you doing? He's taking us for a little ride. Got the old trouble and strife in the back. We're going up the top. What are we going to get? We're getting a distributor, aren't we? Yeah, getting a distributor for the day, so... We're going to get it off the big, the big whale up there, yeah? And then we're going to try and fix uh, a Toyota, yeah? Oh. I always have fun talking with Yeah, I know. <laughs> wow, that was a bit scary. <laughs> Bloke don't like going that fast. <laughs> Just like a dick I thought we was going on bloody roof. Well, we're nearly up top now, so I'll show you when we get up here what we're doing. Well, there's the big whale. I'm opening up the top of the coffin. The tyres, look at the tyres gone. The tyres like fell a bits on it. Oh dear. There's lichens growing on the hood, it's so ancient. Yeah, look at it. Look. Those are real living lichens. Yeah. They grow up north. Wow. Now, if everybody wonders why this doesn't start anymore, I need a carburetor for it. Yeah. Yeah. Thermal, an old thermal quad. Went bad. Around here, that's the problem. No old cars around mm -hmm. here. That one went bad, didn't but it? But we want to steal something off this car. All right. Where is it? Oh no! Don't tell me it's all built into there. Oh no! Looks like oh, it. Oh, is that unplugged? No, it's plugged. In. I think it's all built into there. It doesn't have one. No. No, oh, we wanted that ignition control module. Oh dear. Ah, well, we thought we had one. Burn system. Not good. Oh well. Oh well, this is a useless video. Yeah, that's not very good. The bit we wanted is not on there. So we won't be able to fix that now. That's a shame, isn't it? Ah, nothing else on there we could use, is there? Oh well. Back down, and back to we're thinking again. Alright, we're going to be up to no good. <laughs> we haven't done anything interesting lately, so we decided do something to maybe to satisfy someone's curiosity. What's going to happen if you crush a propane bottle with a bulldozer? <laughs> Does it blow up? Does it get squished? Let's find out. I'll go get one. We have found a suitable candidate. Uh, I'll just back the dozer up onto the field. It hasn't been started for a long time, but since it's near the end of November, we're going to want to have to see if it's going to start and work for plowing snow if it snows this year, as it didn't snow last year. So here's an old start, cold start, it's November, it's like plus 9 degrees Celsius. Let's see if it's got some gas in it, because it's gas and diesel. Oh, it's out of gas. Out of gas. Hang on. <laughs> Where did all that go? <laughs> it's a leak. Oh, okay. Now, I don't think we had any visitors. Right. We need gas then. Here. All right. I'll be back in a sec. We'll come back in a minute. Liquid gold. Oh. Yeah, it's so expensive that some people steal it. How much does it need to start that up? Uh, I only got a half a litre here, so let's see if it'll warm it up enough to switch it over to diesel. It might do. Not that cold today, is it? Oh. It's supposed to be in it, not on it. Oh, that should start her. Well, now I'm going to get started up too. Oh, yeah. I, take, I only drink high test. That was regular. <laughs> Truck with. Oh dear. Let me uh, keep the knob pulled and refill the carburetor. Try again. Is she 
goes. Oh, nearly. Lovely. Works great. Just flatten them into the ground. Yeah, get it. Look at that. I don't think it even leaks. <laughs> I bet there's other things we could bury that way. Yeah. <laughs> That's we'll, flat, we'll though. That's really flat. Hey, Bo, remember our old barbecue you've donated to? Oh, years yeah. Ago? Should let's we do a barbecue? Yeah, let's. Uh, well, let's... What we'll do first is, because it's too tall, we'll just knock it over. Well, I'll back up more in the field and we'll put the blade on it. Yeah, okay. Check how strong the hood is first. We might as well cremate the thing, eh? Because it was, it was a good barbie, wasn't it? Well, yeah, okay. me and Graham will carry it over to the field. That's a good so idea. I'm make a mess on my finely trimmed lawn. Yeah. <laughs> the walking of the barbecue. It don't roll no more, but it walks. <laughs> she's, she's a Coleman special. She's done. A lot of use. <laughs> Coleman special. She was a oh. good Barbie. Well, there's one thing that survived the cast iron burner. It's not broke. Oh, yeah. Well, we can save a few parts. Yeah. Oh, you got the wasset still. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Dave. Um, That's the end of that. A propane tank vertically. Yeah, could try that. Okay, I'm going to back up. Yeah. And then we're going to stand one up vertically. I'm going to put the blade on it and see if it will push it into the ground vertically. All right. Ooh. Yeah. Oh dear. Oh well. Clear up time. Thank you, Al. Can he say you want to crush stuff? <laughs>
Oh well. left the farm that's uh, quite a hoot up there uh, not many people turn up Graham was there as you saw uh, had a bit of a laugh with the dozer right eh? that was quite good um, where are we going now oh yeah we're going to get some sausages some sangers but we're going to get them ones that are, they're already cooked didn't they and they got they're cooked and they got cheese in them they're really good and I've actually that's why I really fancy those. I'm gonna barbecue them, I'm gonna have a couple of beers and put them in a roll with some ketchup and mustard and a little bit of mayo because I like that in mine. It's gonna be really nice. So anyway, I'll show you that when we get home. Right, we're home now. Been shopping. Let me show you what we're having for tea. It's one of my favourites. Um oh, we've got the old basic basics. Not bad though, actually. Let me show you. Look, there's some cheesy smoked sausages. Now, they are fully cooked, love, aren't they? Yeah. Yep, they're fully cooked. Look, oh, is it right there? Look, fully cooked. Ten bucks. Look, how many's in there? Two nine hundred grams lots. There's Twelve in there, and we've got some of these nice long buns. Look, we had them in the freezer. Um, yeah, not bad, eh? That's cheap. Ten bucks, isn't it? Eh? Well, I don't know, probably I'll have about two or three of them, be nice. With a bit of uh, relish and all sorts of stuff and things to put in it, it'd be nice. So, anyhow, looks like someone's had pizza through the day. Maybe the boy, eh? Um, well, I'm going to go now. I want to finish my beer. I want to get this together and eat because I've not eaten anything today. Well, I had a bagel this morning, that's all. And uh, been at a farm. All that fresh air makes you hungry. So, anyhow. I will speak to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.